Farm Guy here, and this is Hall Barn Garage by Regot Z Play on Farming Simulator 22. It's for all platforms, PC, Mac, and console. I'm on PS5 here on the Rock Crawl map for this test and demonstration of these three placeables. Now we have um, an interesting assortment, well, an interesting combination of items here so let's get our help window on and field info on first so the first item we're going to look at is uh this fellow right here now this oddly enough is going to be in buildings and tools and is uh listed as a garage unfortunately there's no repair area in this garage there's no alternate colors and it is 51 slots on console very strange 51 slots for basically it's um a small garage so let's go have a look at it these doors open just like so so it's not even large enough to fit a tractor i don't even think yet it, it it's quite small uh and very pink um inside we have a light switch uh, a lot of decoration. I can see where all the slots are going. We have this door. This door opens and closes. It's an inside room. It's like a lunch room with a whole bunch of junk in it. Um, more slots here and a light. There we go. Lights. Um, right. So, yeah. Curious. It's odd this is included with it. Um, but anyways, that's what it is. Now, the next two items are actually cow barns. So, the first one, uh, well, both of them are in their cows. So, here we got cow barn large and then cow barn large. So, there we have two of them. So, the first one is this one over here. And it's uh, just as so 40 cows. And it's uh, basically a cow barn with a garage section to it. $120,000. The next one is a little bit more interesting. It has a built-in manure collection. So other than that, it is identical to the other one. So let's take a look at this one. This is the one without the collection and we have doors that open and close here. Some really nice detailed stonework on the outside, very nicely decorated. Uh, we have a very large barn area with some interesting and unique doors they're not really doors they're just actually it's uh they're tarps so that's kind of cool and they all pull aside very neatly i do like that idea that's kind of neat uh they tuck away nicely and they don't overlap so you can open the entire side up that's really nice um lights where's the light switch i have forgotten where there it is so here's the light switch for the entire oh it's kind of nice it has like a they don't all pop on at once uh we have an upper area room here with the ladder if you can there, oh come on parkour parkour oh 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 almost uh there's nothing there's nothing really to note up here oh there's another light switch here for the upper area there we go now i gotta uh come on there we go um, yeah, so just a bunch more decorations up here that um, soak up the slot count. Uh, small man door here. If you couldn't push your way through the tarpaulin, I'm pretty sure that man door would not ever get used if it was me. Now we have the cow barn section. Uh, cows are all inside. Oh, there's only 40 cows, so it's not a large cow barn. We have a couple of outside doors. We have a uh, another kind of a garage area here with a light. There we go. Turn the light on. So that door slides. That's a sliding door. This one's no door, just open. And to the side here, we have another, uh, this is the milk area, milk loading area. And then we have two doors here. So, uh, you pretty much can only have one door open at a time because you can see it slides over and blocks the other door. So, uh, we have a light switch here 
and this light switch here is for the barn milking area there so you can see milk here um, food and straw it does take bales we'll show that later another uh, here's the animal dialogue 40 cows another door here slurry output here I have placed down a base game uh, manure heap and if we run over to the other one uh, it is identical to the one we just looked at except that it has this this um, I um, this is the manure pit the built-in manure pit so if we take a look over here and um, yes so does this door open no um, I didn't put any cows in here huh let's do that right now cows there we go 40 cows So, uh, this reminds me of, uh, you can see two, two wires, um, there should be, maybe not, I wonder if it's animated, there'd be like a shovel scoop kind of thing that um, the wire would pull across the floor, collecting the manure, and it would drag it out here, and pile the manure out here, but we're going to see what that looks like uh, once we run it. And I think it's just kind of like it's a it's a decoration, and then we're gonna watch. Hopefully, it works. But um, there, that's it. So we're gonna run ahead a month and see what all happens. But we're gonna take a look at our capacities first: fifty thousand liters of straw, sixty thousand liters of food capacity. Right. So that should be enough for forty cows, I would think. I, you'd think I'd know by now for sure. But anyways, we'll see you in a bit. All right, first of off, uh, first off, we have the um, the cow barn without the manure pit. And as you can see here, I've placed one down and it's collected 8,000 liters of manure. And if we take a look, uh, food capacity and straw oh, has barely went down at all. So um, yeah, no problem with food capacity. Uh, milk and slurry has been collected as well now these this entrance to this oh is this even gonna fit in there this is a small tractor and oh there's no collision okay no collision there either oh alrighty then well I guess that solves that problem I don't know how much of a non-collision you can get away with but uh, here is the base game wel welder trailer and oh yeah there is a collision on the roof so probably uh, using a side dump we can change that to uh, once it lowers down uh, grain door left yes so even though there's no collision driving in, we just barely made it in there with that small trailer. Let's go over to the other one. And I don't see any manure. Oh dear. That seems to be an issue of late with a lot of the cow barns that have the built-in manure. And it says zero liters manure. So, on, well, we're going to... Hmm. Hmm. Straw has gone down, and uh, so what I'm going to do, in case, by some chance, some very odd chance, that that manure pit was collecting this manure. Uh, you see, I deleted that manure pit, so the only manure pit around on this map is right here. And um, so let's go ahead and put some food in there. Now let's go with uh, tip side right and make sure this works here. Looks like this had more clearance. Okay, there we go. All right, so food goes in. I will get a grab a bale. 
Oh, well that's collision there. Uh, was that the was that the trailer or is that the collision? Oh, well, unfortunately, this one has a collision here. Uh, the other one didn't. Well, that's kind of annoying. Uh, let's just get that out of there. Oh dear. Uh, trailer. Let's just let's just get rid of that trailer. Okay. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Right, um, okay, let me grab this uh, straw bale. All right, straw bale, and as you can see, as we come closer here, the straw disappears. Well, at least it's went down. We have refilled it. It didn't really use that much straw. Right, so, bales, yes, bales, food in. Uh, this looks like this has a collision here, so you're going to need something pretty tiny to get um, the food in to that barn right so I'm gonna run it again make sure this uh, manure pit is gonna give it the old college try to make sure that manure pit has its best chance to collect manure and I'm gonna go grab some tanks to make sure the slurry and milk works uh, the triggers work too so we'll be back all right well um, odd things are happening here um, so I went four months and no manure appeared here at all so I decided well let's put down a manure heap and see if it'll collect it there so I put the base game manure heap down and as you can see no manure in there but guess what <laughs> now all of a sudden the manure appears here uh, that's um, oddly enough that's uh, yeah so um, kind of defeats the purpose of having a built-in manure pit although yeah I don't know what to say about that um, so let's let's check the uh, slurry trigger and yes that slurry trigger works so Definitely needs some kind of update to to get that to work without having to put down a manure pit. It seems just a tad odd that you would need to do that. But anyways, that's what it's doing on console anyways. And there we go. Slurry's produced there and picked up. That trigger works. Let's go over to the milk trigger, which is should be right over here. Oh, there it is. And yes, milk trigger works zip on over to the other milk trigger and then we're going to test the manure trigger uh whoops where is it why am i lost there's the milk trigger and there it is start filling milk yes okay so let's just uh quickly zip over here and grab this trailer and test out that manure um, the manure trigger and then we're done so here's the manure trigger and start filling yes okay so huh, strange oddness I'm not sure why it wouldn't work until I placed a manure heap and then it started collecting there so something's a little squirrely this is this is on console PS5 so uh, there you have it that is the Hull Barn Garage by Rajat G Play on Farming Simulator 22 thank you all for watching and remember it's only a game so till the next one bye for now